ISP is excited to announce its second annual Images of Distinction competition. I'm talking with Andrew Jenkins, who is going to be a jury chair for the ASP IOD. How are you doing, sir? Super fantastic. How are you doing, Bob? Uh, fabulous. Hey, tell me a little bit about the kind of photography you do. Well, I'm a portrait photographer. I have a studio in uh, St. John's, Mich Michigan, which is just north of Lansing. And uh, we, you know, we mostly do, uh, you know, all your typical portrait stuff, you know, family, children, high school, seniors, weddings. Uh, and then we also have a volume side of our business as well, where we're, where we do um, school portraits and, you know, sports leagues and stuff like that as well. Cool. Do you remember your first merit or loan image? I do. Yes. Um, my first merit was in the competition of 1999. Uh, I didn't know much about entering competition and I had some black and white fiber-based prints that I had printed myself and and someone told me I should enter them in the competition and I did pretty well my first year and and I still have that uh, actually that portrait hanging up in my studio today. Hey, um, how long have you been a judge? Uh, I have been a judge for, boy, I don't know. I feel like about since... 2007 or eight or so in there. Um, and uh, yep, love, absolutely love it. Cool. Tell us the difference between uh, being a judge and a jury chair. Well, um, you know, the, the difference is when you're jury chairman, you are kind of, um, you know, the leader of the team, if you will. You're kind of there to facilitate, to make sure that the team is working um, and going in the right direction to get wonderful results for the makers. Um, and so you're kind of, you're, you, I don't want to say like you're in charge or anything along those lines, um, but you're just kind of there as, if you will, like a director of an of a orchestra, if you will, that's just kind of there to kind of make sure that all the team members work in unison. And obviously when you're a judge, it's the same kind of thing, um, but you just have to be one of those team members to work, you know, side by side with the other teammates to, uh, to, uh, to do the job. So in short, it's the panel that actually scores. It's not any one individual judge or jury chair. It's the entire panel that that cur that creates the score. Sure, absolutely. You know, it's it's a team working together to, uh, to come up with the finished result of what that score would be for that for that image. And it's it's really an awesome process, if you ask me. Yeah, I, I agree. What? Um, why did you become a judge, Andrew? You know, it's something that I that I love. It's probably my most favorite part of being involved in in PP of A, um, and it's more about the people too. You know, the the the, fe the fellow judges are my closest friends in the industry, um, but then also you know just helping new people in that are coming into photography, that type of thing, to help them, um, you know, start down that same journey that we went. It's just it's just awesome to do. So. That's why I really enjoy it. If you had, uh, let's take impact out of the 12 elements, which one jumps into your head? Go. But you know, you gotta kind of look at the 12 elements um, all working together in unison to to have a great end result. So I don't think there's, that there's any necessarily one that jumps out that like, that I say, well, this is way more important than the other or that type of thing. Um, I do think that you can kind of say impact a little bit just cause that's gonna invoke emotion right off the bat. But really, the impact only comes when the other 11 elements are put together so well um, to, to have that result. So um, I guess I'm going to kind of give you, I'm going to punt on that answer and say I don't Fair really enough. have, I don't have a favorite child, Bob. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Hey, if you had a piece of advice for new makers and even older makers who are still uh, in image competition, what would it be? Um, I would say just, you know, just, can, just keep, keep going at it, you know, whether you're new or, or if you're a seasoned, seasoned photographer that's been entering forever, just, you know, continue to keep entering and keep making yourself better. Um, you know, there's not a session that doesn't go by that I don't think about something like, you know, I might be photographing a family and I might say, you know what, I'm just going to go, go ahead and fix this or fix that. Um, and it's all because, you know, that family's probably not going to recognize it, but I think, you know, I always kind of think about competition in mind and what I would need to do um, to make these images great for competition. Um, so I would just say, you know, just continue to participate throughout your entire career, um, just because I think you not only do you get a lot out of it, other people get a lot out of it for seeing your work and learning from your work. But then it also makes your client work better, um, which ultimately is probably the most important thing. Um, 
only because it's going to make you more money more financially. Money. <laughs> yeah. Yep. And more successful as a photographer. Andrew Jenkins, jury chair for ASP IOD 2022. How about that? It's going to be big fun. Looking forward to it. Mark your calendars now and get ready for the ASP Images of Distinction. So, looking okay in my face? Oh, yeah. Uh, your little your face is a little hot, if that matters. Just a touch. Now it's getting hotter. Hotter. Ah! <laughs> He's burning up! 